Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you guys are in the world. I hope you guys are having a good day. Welcome back. If you're new to the channel, my name is David Saracha. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button. Also, right next to the subscribe button is also this little bell icon. If you don't mind, can you just tap it for a little bit? That way, every time when I post a new video, you guys will get notified. So, nine years ago, I had a chance to go to Biloxi, Mississippi. Uh, Biloxi, Mississippi is kind of like the Las Vegas of the South. Put it that way. So anyways, uh, you know, I had a good time back then and then so today I'm going to take you guys, I'm going to take my family back to Biloxi. And no, I don't have a gambling problem. I just have, you know, I just go there for, you know, the buffet, honestly. But you know what, you, since you put it this way, maybe I do have a problem. I have a, you know, I'm gambling with my health for you guys. You know, eating on this buffet. I'm just kidding. But anyways, um, the place that we're going to go to is called the Palace Casino Resort. Um, they have billboard all of the highway saying that they have the best buffet in Biloxi. So we're going to go there and check them out. Most places have the best buffet on the weekend, you know, on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. But today, we are going to go here on a Tuesday just to catch them off guard. So anyways, if you are ready, let's go. A.K.A. Vominos. The drive from Houston to Biloxi takes about 6 hours. We're gonna pass through Lake Charles. This is where I did my Golden Nugget Video Buffet. The bridge that we're on right now is the third longest bridge in the US. It's called the Achafalaya Basin Bridge, also known as the 20 Mile Bridge. Next stop is Baton Rouge. We're gonna stop by here on the way back just to check out some restaurants and a couple other places. So finally, we're here in Biloxi, Mississippi. At this point, I was asking my wife, what time does the buffet close? And she told me that it closed at 9 p.m. So I was like, what? It's already 8 p.m. And what kind of buffet closes at 9 p.m. on the weekdays? And I still have another 20 minutes drive to the buffet. Anyways, it's cool. So to our left is the IP Casino. The last time I was here, I had the buffet here and it was so delicious. So we're definitely gonna stop by here for lunch tomorrow. Right in front of us is the Beau Rivage. That's where we stayed here last time. Very nice hotel. Remind me of the Bellagio. Sorry about the shakiness. This was nine years ago. So right in front of us, there's a beach. And along the beach, there are so many casinos. We have the Hot Rock Hotel and Casinos, the Golden Nugget, and finally, the Palace Casino Resort. It's 8.30 p.m. so we have 30 minutes to eat and film. So I'm sorry in advance but this buffet video might feel a little bit rushed. But I still hope you guys enjoy it. So this is the fun entrance of the resort. Very nice. Check this out guys. Cool huh? So the buffet is located on the second floor. The same floor as the casino. Here's the price list and the hour of operations. We didn't have much time so I didn't get a player club's card so I can save $2 on the buffet. But $23 for a dinner buffet is really not that bad at all. Let's see what they have for us to eat. What do we have here? We got chicken parmesan, pizza, enchilada, all the Mexican stuff. We got grilled veggies, grilled onions, barbecue chicken, sausage. And over here we have the uh, meat pop station, the prime ribs, barbecue pork ribs, brisket, turkey, and stuff to go with it. I got the comfort food. Let's see. They got ground gravy, corn, collard greens. Dirty rice, biscuits, hello, how are you? Chicken, fried chicken pizza, chicken liver, how you stay? Here we got the walk. Walk your way. Pick whatever you want. Then They'll grill it for you. They grill it for you. Let's see. You got pineapple chicken. Five veggies. Beef chow mein. And over here you have a little sushi 
station. I got I got bring my baby to do this. Here we have chicken, fried catfish, fried clams, the crab, fried shrimp. We have spicy shrimp. All the good shrimp you can get. This remind me of the uh, buffet and uh, the wind buffet. Hello sir, how are you doing today? Make your pasta. So over here we have the dessert sections. You have all kinds of pies, cheesecake, chocolate cakes. And this is where the make your own salad bar begins. You have spinach, lettuce, mushroom, cucumber, and all kinds of dressing. And over here we have the pre-mixed salad, ready to eat, such as bacon ranch salad. And then you have your pudding and fresh fruit, such as pineapple, cantaloupe, orange. And then out of nowhere we got some seafood gumbo with white rice and chicken okra soup. So I guess over here is where the dessert section start. So we have some carrot cake, vanilla cake, over here by this corner we have some cranberry coconut macaroon, apple chudo, sugar free cookies, and then you have some peach cobbler and some bread pudding. So that concludes the buffet tour. At this point, they told us to grab everything that we want to eat because at 9 p.m. they will clean up everything. So I started to grab everything. Chicken gizzard, chicken liver, fried clam, boiled shrimp, prime rib, everything. The prime rib was a little bit red so he was nice enough to throw it on the grill for me. And this is the result. It looked really good too. In less than seven minutes, I was able to grab a seafood plate, a meat plate, another seafood plate, comfort food plate, a salad, and a bunch of dessert. All right, let's eat because I'm hungry. Well, you know what? It's more like, let's eat because we are hungry. Let's try the prime rib while it's still hot. Prime rib, good. Oh, no. not bad. Tastes like Popeye chicken. Dessert, bread pudding, and a peach cobbler. Got the peach cobbler first. Pizza apple was good. Mm. Hot bread. No, what? Oh. That pudding. Oh, that pudding is good. Carrot cake. Mm. 
pancake's good. And don't worry guys, I make sure I finish all of my food so nothing will go to waste. Overall, I thought the food was pretty good. For the amount of money that we paid. I think it was $49 for two. So about $25. Uh, we got here late, so kind of rush through this meal. But everything we have was, you know, good. Anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm sorry it was a little bit rushed. Thank you so much for you staying to the end. Be sure to hit the subscribe button on your way out. And I'll see you soon.